Hey y'all, I'm Senator Holly Thompson Rader from Southeast Missouri. This week we worked on two bills that I wanted to tell you about that are very Im important to me as well as to many of our constituents back home. It is One is birth certificates for domestic violence victims. If victims have to quickly leave an abusive situation, there can be very little time to plan when their safety and the safety of their family are on the line. Vital records like a birth certificate are essential to a survivor of domestic violence being able to restart their life. Birth certificates are necessary in order to obtain a driver's license, set up a bank account, obtain permanent residence or employment, all of which are critical to gaining independence and safety. The second one is requiring consent for a pelvic exam in medical hospitals, which seems completely bizarre that you would um, need to have this piece of legislation. And I was floored when I found out about this. But what we have is in some of our teaching hospitals, if you are under anesthesia, say for a, a knee surgery, or you're knocked out because you have, you're undergoing some medical um, surgery, then a lot of times, pelvic exams were being done as a teaching protocol, but the person who is under anesthesia doesn't know that that is what is going on. When it comes to those who have been uh, sexually abused, that to find out that you were given an, a pelvic exam without your consent while under anesthesia, that is a horrific finding. Myself and another senator went together to co-sponsor this bill, and I'm excited to say that both of them have come out of the Senate this week. The Senate will stand adjourned under the rules. So in closing, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, Senate recap for this week, and we will try to keep you informed as we go through, I think we have six weeks left. <laughs>